Hello everybody. Welcome to Secret Horses channel. Today we are going to go over some interesting topic that's astonishing fact about the horses. On number 1, horses have a wide range of vision. Horses are, are eyes are located on the sides of their heads. Horses eyes are located on the sides of their heads. So they have a wide range of vision and have a blind spots only immediately in front of any behind their bodies horses mostly use monocular vision when both eyes are used separately that means horses can see and process different thing happening on different side of its body when a horse switches its binocular vision it focus both eyes on single object in front of it on number 2 horses can vomit Two, oh, two horses are physically incapable of vomiting. There are number of anatomical reason for this, such as strength of the muscles in the esophagus. The specific way the esophagus connect to the horse stomach and the location of the stomach itself. The evolutionary reason for this isn't known for sure, but the theory is that it is protective. The back and forth motion of the full gallop could theoretically induce vomiting that would allow a predator to catch it. So evolution may have eliminated the concern entirely. On number 3, they are related to Rhinoceros. Horses are member of genus Equus, which is considered the only extinct group in the horse family. The genus includes not only the domestic horse but also the Kawasaki horses, zebras and asses such as donkeys. But they are not horses closest living relatives as an odd toed ungulated the horses is closest relative to the similarly hooved Rhinoceros. On number 4, its Arabian horse has a unique build. Arabian horses stand out to be historically important, particularly to the culture and lives of the desert tribes in the Middle East. But they are also distinct from the other horse breed because of their unique build. Arabian has a great bone density than other horses. They also have a shorter back with the fewer lumbar vertebra. Additionally, Arabian have one fewer pair of ribs and their ribs are set wider apart. And while they known for carrying their tails high like flag behind them and they may have less to do with the high spirit and more due to having two fewer tail vertebrate than other horse breeds. Number 5. Pony and miniature horses are different. All miniature horses are ponies, but not all ponies are miniature horses. Any horse that is shorter than 14.2 hands at the vitered quality as a pony miniature horses measured between 34 to 38 inches tall which put them separately pony category in addition to being their own group many enthusiasts consider miniature ponies to be distinct breed of horses it maintains standard horse body proportion unlike ponies that have shorter legs longer body and overall stocky build number 6 Horse this contain lots of information a lot can be learned about the horse to its teeth starting with the gender male and female horses have a different number of teeth male have 44 while female have between 36 and 44 so if you ever look at the horse skulls you can likely discredit the gender simply by counting its teeth you can estimate the horse age by looking at its teeth according to the university of missouri can be done by observing of occurrence of permanent teeth and the disappearance of cups the shapes of the surface of the teeth and angle at which the top and bottom rows meet number 7 there is only one true wild horse species there is only a species of horse that it's truly wild it had a narrow breast with extension and it listed as a endergard on the iuc ride this may comes as a surprise and there is a multiple horse breed that are often considered to be wild the american mustang australian brumpy and exmoor pony to the name of few but these horses are technically feral not wild on number 8 they have a muscular ear horses ear may small but they are might each ear contain 10 muscles and can move 180 degree from facing directly towards a directly backward means forward and backward both they can be distinguished and identify distinct sounds by directing their ear to a specific area horses also use the ears to communicate such as pinning them back to indicate anger or guidance horses were found to make decision based on where another ear were pointing telling us the animal may use their ear to direct each other 
On number nine, horses' funny faces aren't laughter. When the horse curls its upper lips and raises its head in the air, many people say its funny faces are expression of laughter, but that inaccurate. Behavior is called as fleeman response. It's about getting better whiff of interesting smells. This action allows pheromones and other skin to transfer to the vomular organ VMO, which then sends signal to the brain that can trigger physiological and behavioral reaction. Stallion shows the flashman response most often as they pick up the pheromones of mares. Mares with flashman shortly after birth as respond to the pheromin of their newly born foal. On number 10, one horse breed has a metallic coat. The Akatika horse is a famous for its coat. While many well tanned horses are beautiful, saying this breed boosts an eye catching metallic sign. It has to do with the structure of its hair. In most horse breeds, hair strands have an opaque coat, but for Akalatika, that core is extremely small or even competitively absent. The transparent part of hair takes its places, bending and retracting light, and it passes through there, giving each hair as appearance shimmer. On and not last, 11 horses are highly intelligent. Horses are intelligent creators and they are studied to prove it. The horses were able to distinguish between familiar and unfamiliar human by their voices alone. Horses could also be the opposite, telling the different using just the sight and smell of the people, not hearing their voices. Please subscribe to our channel and click on bell icon so you cannot miss any new video launch. Thank you.